by Doha. The headquarters of the Southwest Regional State was once known for its vibrant agriculture, but has become the epicenter of Somalia's devastating humanitarian crisis in recent years. Prolonged drought and insecurity have forced thousands in the region into internally displaced camps. But there's a beacon of hope amid adversity. SOS Children's Villages has introduced a new farming project using a revolutionary technique known as hydroponic farming. It is a method of growing crops without soil. Plants are suspended in a nutrient-rich water solution, providing everything they need to thrive. Smart farming. I'm hydroponic. Court of Bandor never been Bahania, B. Oyer, Yen Bahan Bibang Bahang, Tanamada Ben Bahania Nafago Zaydam Bahang. Tofauti Kunayo Kuba, Wa Krima, who are hydroponics, Sababu to Natumia Pushon Tuk Dogo, Natunapata Mada or Mingi Kuriko, either traditional farming, and you report to Nafania upon Bereni. So that we can use like uh, half an acre and we can get uh, Mada or Mingi. Kama ya ika mzima. Na pia inasaidia sana kwa kukontrol pest na magonjwa ya mchanga. This innovative approach offers several advantages including reduced water usage and increased yields. For example, the method uses up to 90% less water than traditional farming, a crucial benefit in a drought-stricken region. It produces higher yields in smaller spaces, leading to greater food security. Anisha <laughs> Mark Bolki Bobol Eda, Ya Tihor Itan, Michel Duni, Tanga Eight for Eden Kudremheim. In Somalia, where the poverty level stands at 73% and 70% of the population is under 30 years old, SOS Children's Villages is empowering the local communities, particularly young people, by providing training and creating employment opportunities in managing hydroponic farms. This provides income and equips them with valuable skills for the future. The target is to directly benefit 300 women and 200 youth and support approximately 500 households or 3,000 people. Comparative research by Zamzam University in Baidoa has shown better results from clever hydroponic farming methods than traditional farming. The residents have embraced this initiative with enthusiasm. Crops grown through hydroponics are now finding their way to local supermarkets, generating income, creating job opportunities, and contributing to the local food market. I was able to get a lot of money to Reaping the benefits of hydroponic farming methods in Baidoa is a testament to human resilience and the power of innovation. It offers a sustainable solution to food insecurity, empowers young people, and brings hope for a brighter future in this drought stricken region.